Dr. Eli Jabour, always a pleasure to hang out with you. The and pleasure is you. all mine. American Society of Hematology, it's buzzing. Everybody is running around and we actually told you you're going to a meeting, but before you go, you have to stop and tell us in the world of acute lymphoblastic leukemia, what's happening at ASH? We're curing leukemia. This is what's happening at ASH. In fact, yes. what we're seeing at ASH is that we're integrating immune therapy to the front line of ALL. And in adult patient, we're showing survival at four years of 85%, something never achieved before. And that brings us to the thing that we thought about at the beginning, that it's time to cure ALL in adult patient. And we see the level of remissions and long-term remission becoming close to what we see in pediatric, which is a major breakthrough. That is in a pH negative ALL. In a pH positive ALL, we're seeing the integration of immune therapy to the front line as well. And we have data showing blinaponatib into the front line, having survival of 95% at two or three years, which is amazing. So so in doing though, are you integrating MRD in your decision making? You know, Shadi, you cannot eat ALL without MRD assessment. Yes, in fact, MRD will allow us to tailor therapy accordingly and to maybe de-escalate and treat a la carte based on MRD assessment, provided we use the right testing at the right time. And I think today with the integration of MRD assessment, with the new therapies available, the cure is at our hands. So in relapse disease, my last question, because you're doing so much good stuff in frontline disease, what is happening in the relapse world? What drugs are you really looking forward to see their activity? You know, in the relapse world, uh, if you relapse with ALL, the death sentence used to be, then we get the immune therapy that have a survival benefit. Doing CAR We're doing CAR-Ts, but I think these options are not like one or the other. I think the best strategy is to design something that allow you to complement in these drugs in a complementary fashion. And today, for example, CAR-T will have a better role if used in MRD setting and as a phenyl therapy to replace allotransplant. And that is being tested right now. So from immune therapy followed by CAR-T, short sequence of therapy that can get you to the cure. This is amazing. Thank you for everything you're doing. And thank you for the Hemang Pulse, visiting with the Hemang Pulse on blood cancers today. Thank you so much. Curing cancer one day at a time. Of course. Thank you.